And look, it's, it's clear the nationalists can't work out how to answer the question, how can, how can Scotland lose £15 billion a year uh, of a fiscal transfer from the rest of the UK without massive cuts? Because £15 billion a year, uh, more is spent on public services in Scotland than is raised in taxation. They now can, they can't fill it with uh, oil revenues because uh, the oil is, is, is now running out. And anyway, the SNP are committed to keeping oil uh, in, and gas uh, in the North Sea because mm. they're uh, into net zero faster than the rest of the UK. Are. Is, is the worry here, example. though, John, is the worry here that this is a conversation that the SNP would like unionists to be having? It, 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 it almost belittles Scotland to say that uh, Scotland relies upon the English taxpayer, that without the English taxpayer, Scotland couldn't do it itself. Do, 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 is, are, are we playing their game a little bit there by simply talking about fiscal transfer rather than the emotional connection to, to being one country that so many people ought to feel? No, look, I don't think so, because after a certain point, facts are so big, they can't be denied. And the SNP attempts to go, it's all about heart, it's not about head. Seriously, um, £15 billion, pounds, that's the size of the funding of the whole of the NHS in Scotland. It's a lot of money. Of course, Scotland could be independent. It's just it couldn't have public services at the same level that it has at the moment without massive hikes in taxation and massive hikes in borrowing. Uh, well, we, we, 